Hey, what's going on? Um, in this video, I want to talk about how to calm down someone who's very angry, uh, what to do about that, and how it really relates to sales and marketing, um, and a lot more about that as well. Now, before I begin, uh, down below there's a description and a link. If you click on that link, there's actually training on what I believe is the most important part of marketing a product or service online, um, and that is on how to convert um, and actually transfer someone's attention to money. Now, I've been reading this book called The Wolf of Wall Street by Jordan Belfort. Um, they made this movie called, uh, well, excuse me, The Way of the Wolf is the book. But they made the movie The Wolf of Wall Street, right, about him and his whole lifestyle and everything like that. But it's a really good book. It's about his closing system, uh, the straight line system, uh, which, you know, he was a successful salesperson. He was. Um, and he talks about states a lot. Uh, states is like your mindset. You know, Tony, even Tony Robbins talks about states a lot. Like if you're in a negative state, you're not going to win. It's very hard to. If you're against yourself, I mean, yeah, what are you going to do, right? Over. Um, and Jordan, in the book, he tells a story which is really pretty interesting about his son. And one night his fiance tells him, hey, listen, your son, he's getting all upset over here. He's all pissed off and angry. Can you do something to calm him down? Okay. And... This is what he tells in the story, which is really pretty good, interesting. Here's what I didn't do, he says. I didn't go downstairs. I didn't go down there and all soft and sympathetic and be like, oh, look, I was trying to calm him down. Like, hey, buddy, you know, I know you're really upset right now, uh, but you shouldn't let someone get to you that way. It's not good for you. Why? Why do you think he didn't? it wasn't a good idea to do that? Because he would have gotten even mad, uh, angrier, right? He'd been like, don't get upset. What do you mean, don't get upset? That fucking guy's a ball hog. Blah, 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 blah. Rah, 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 rah. We should get him thrown off the team. Whip him. Right? Um, and then, you know, he would have been like, oh, calm down, buddy. In which case, he would have gotten even madder, you know, because he, he entered at a different state, basically. Uh, he would have been entered at a calm state when he's at an angry state. It doesn't match, right? So... What he did is he walked in, which is pretty brilliant if you think about it. He walked in as pissed off and angry as his son. In fact, he even got angrier, right? Just to match his state. Uh, he came in with his voice booming. What the hell's going on, Carter? Oh, I know that bastard kid's a ball hog, but we got to do something. We got to get him thrown off that team. We're going to go get him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, basically match his state. Uh, and then, uh, obviously, you know, his son would have matched him, right? Like, yeah, 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 you're right. Yeah, we got to get that guy, blah, 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 blah. Uh, and then what he did was when he matched his state, then he lowered his voice and brought it down a notch. And more sympathetic tone was like, oh, he shook his head sadly. I don't know, buddy. I wonder what caused him to act this way. You know, you think he has some emotional problems or something, something else going on. And then the son's like, yeah, maybe you're right. And it kind of, it kind of breaks down a little bit. Uh, and just like that, he calmed down. So it's a brilliant way to, you know, de-escalate a situation. And so matching is a way to calm somebody down. Now, I remember I talked about earlier how this relates to sales and marketing. And with Jordan, he did, he has... He does the same thing in sales. For example, if somebody's calm, he'll match them and be calm. And then what he does, he's, he gets a little bit excited and he the, the, the prospect gets excited. And he gets a little bit more excited and they get a little more excited. And that excitement, that enthusiasm, um, it does help um, in sales. Obviously, there's a lot more variables involved and factors. But it's a really interesting idea because on a statewide level, state level, you know, buying is an emotional part. It's logical too, but it's also emotional. So bringing someone's excitement emotionally uh, can definitely help. Anyway, I thought that was a pretty cool story. I want to share it with you. Uh, let me know what you think. If you like this video, if you learned something, hit the thumbs up button. Share it too. Uh, now, like I mentioned earlier, if you are interested in um, sales online, thanks to the internet, I mean, it just opens up so many doors. Uh, one of the things I highly encourage you and recommend is learning this skill set of turning that attention into dollars because if you think about it, that is the most important part of online marketing. Without that transaction, transaction of somebody giving you money 
over the internet. You don't have nothing. It doesn't matter how many subscribers, likes, followers, fans, blah, 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 you have. It doesn't. And I know from personal experience. So learn from my mistake. Okay? Um, start there. It's a very important skill to learn. It's the va most valuable skill to learn. And um, if you want to learn more, uh, just click that link below. Um, I think it's wonderful. Okay? Uh, highly encourage it. Anyways, uh, thanks for your time um, and have a very wonderful rest of your day.